What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Dirtbag Dan. Um, we're here in not so beautiful San Jose, California today. El Nino and this motherfucker. Uh, wanted to make a little blog explaining the situation behind uh, Dot not showing up to Battle of the Zay 5. Unfortunately, um, I think there's been a bit of misconception as far as like why he didn't show up is. I posted online that he missed his flight, and I think that the general consensus based on that statement was is that he just was like late to the airport or some shit. In fact, uh, he hit me up about 18 hours before the event and just said flat out that he wasn't coming. Didn't really uh, provide a reason as far as why he wasn't coming. Um, said he'd been trying to get a hold of me, but it's not like I'm a hard motherfucker to get a hold of. And he had my phone number because we talked when he picked up his deposit. You know what I mean? So kind of completely bullshit on the terms. But uh, being a responsible individual that I am, I actually paid for flight insurance. So I informed him that if he wanted to make this battle happen, if he wanted to continue to go through with this and couldn't because of some kind of personal issue or whatever was keeping him from doing the battle, I said that he can call the airline because it, it's not on the uh, person who purchases the ticket. It's on the flyer. I said that he can call the airline and uh, he could have it fixed. You know what I mean? And we could push that flight to a later date and we can get that battle done on a later date. Of course, Sam Colt is in the area. We plan on doing a bunch of different tryout events leading up to the next big battle of the Zay. And, and that would be a great headline battle for any of those cards. Basically, I was trying to make the battle happen and I did whatever I could to make the battle happen. Unfortunately, uh, Dodd is just wildly fucking unprofessional i mean like with the whole calling me on 18 hours notice and, and canceling for no good reason and then on top of that making no effort to fix the situation even though he said you know what i mean he could i could tell from the uh text messages that that he felt like it was a bad move uh not showing up to this event it really was because i mean i feel like the door is probably closed as far as west coast battle endeavors go for him and i don't know what his relationship is like with url i know uw is not fucking with him and i know he's not showing up to other battles like uh some league in indiana or whatever at the end of the day if i had i had that knowledge prior that he was like on a streak of being a dick and not showing up to these battles i probably wouldn't have booked him the truth is is that booking dot was kind of an afterthought because i had had a battle for sam colt already locked and that opponent bitched out so uh Basically, um, I had already been in contact with Bill's manager, Bill Collector's manager. Uh, shouts out to Bill Collector, by the way. Uh, cool cat to hang out with. And uh, he came out and I probably got him too stoned. <laughs> but that's what we do. And uh, shouts out to Philly Black, uh, who's Dot and Bill's manager, the one who I, I locked this deal with. I mean, he's he's been trying to do whatever he can to make it right. And I understand that... Uh, this whole situation was a big surprise to him as well. According to him, uh, Dot is the one who reached out to him and wanted to come out to the West Coast. And um, being that Bill was already coming, it just seemed like a natural fit. And it probably would have been, and it would have been dope for him, but unfortunately we weren't able to make that happen. We're talking about like hundreds of dollars that were lost here, not thousands of dollars, not the type of shit you fucking really go nuts for. I mean, not if you're me, cost of living is high out here. Fuck, spend that at the bar tonight, but it is a, a shitty representation of his character as, as a battle rapper and as a person, really. And, um, you know, we ain't going to go to fucking small claims court. At the end of the day, wasted our time and wasted our money. I, I wouldn't recommend anybody else book that dude. Very talented, ultra talented. But, I mean, you really can't count on him showing up. And that's so much of the game is, is fucking showing up. So, uh Hope that clears up everything. Uh, feel free to leave questions in the comments and then maybe I can clear them up on the podcast. Shouts out again to everybody who came out to Battle of the Zay 5 and helped make it a fucking dope event. Thank you guys.